Lesson 4.11 is finding a coordinate that makes a segment parallel or perpendicular. So remember, make sure you're reading if it says, do they want parallel lines or perpendicular? So we've got some points here. We've got a point at L, M, N, and O. See how we don't know what Y is? So it says find Y such that line LM is parallel to NO. So you should be thinking, hey, parallel lines, I know the slopes are the same. So I would be finding the slope of LM and then that's going to be 3 minus negative 6, so 3 plus 6 over negative 3 minus negative 6 plus 6. That would be 3 plus 6 is 9, 6 minus 3 is 3, slope is 3. So what I want to do now is make another slope equation. I get a different color. For n to o. So I would have y minus 9 over negative 3 minus 3. And what do I want this slope to come out to be? Well, I want it to come out to be the same as LM, which was 3. And so I'm going to simplify the bottom. So I've got y minus 9 over negative 6 equals 3. And then what I've created is a multi-step equation, or you could see it as a proportion, because this is over 1. Proportions, you cross multiply, or think about a multiplying by this negative 6. So then I get y minus 9 equals negative 18. And then all I have to do is add 9. So y must be negative 9. And that's all it wanted, was just a coordinate. So if I were to find the slope again of these two points, now knowing that this is at negative 3, negative 9, it should equal the same slope as LM. Let's try one more. This time it's the same thing except for we want perpendicular. So remember I'm going to have to do negative reciprocal slopes. Okay, so PQ is what I'm going to find the slope of first. <clears throat> That's going to be negative 3 minus 1 over 1 plus 1 would be negative 4 over 2, which is negative 2. So now the slope that I really want is going to be now positive 1 half. So I'm going to find the slope of RS and set it equal to what I want the slope to be, which is positive 1 half. So I'm going to do negative 7 plus 4 over x minus 0. Lucky for me, that's going to just go away. So negative 7 plus 4 is negative 3 over x equals 1 half. This really is a proportion where I want to cross multiply. So 1 times x is 1x or x. Negative 3 times 2 is negative 6. I have nothing to divide by, so x must be negative 6.